From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Rory Johnston with your updated headlines. We are up to 906 cases of COVID-19 in Tennessee. That's up 133 cases just in the last 24 hours. 257 of those are in Davidson County, another 170 out in the Memphis area, Shelby County. 53 Tennesseans have been hospitalized so far with the virus. Three have died. If you're looking for more information on how to get tested or any other questions about COVID-19, there are now three information lines available. Nashville just launched their own. The local number 615-862-7777. It's open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. every day. The state still has their line up and running. You can actually call it at two separate numbers. Toll free 833-556-2476 and also 877-857-2945. All these numbers and more information on COVID-19 listed on our website. Well, the National Guard is getting ready to help fight the spread of the virus here in Tennessee. 250 National Guard soldiers and airmen have already been mobilized and hundreds more are on standby. State officials say Guard members will first go to Smyrna where they'll get specialized equipment and training and then they'll be deployed across the state to help with COVID-19 testing. Those officials also stress these National Guard's men and women are being mobilized for humanitarian efforts, not law enforcement purposes. Tennessee State Parks urging everyone to only visit their local state parks. All 56 state parks are transitioning to day use schedules tomorrow. All public gathering spaces though, like visitor centers, shelters and playgrounds will be closed. In addition to that, cabins, lodges, campgrounds, golf courses and clubhouses will also be closed. Hiking trails and some bathrooms will remain open. All right, now with the latest on the weather, let's go to Henry. Well, as we go through the overnight quiet conditions out there, maybe a cloud here or there. Temperatures in the 40s in many locations. Thursday, we will see a partly cloudy sky at times, but temperatures 70s and 80s getting into the afternoon hours. Southerly wind in control, so a beautiful day forecasted across the area. That will also be the story jumping into your Friday. Hey, speaking of Friday, you've got uh, 80 tomorrow, 83 on Friday, 78 with some storm chances Saturday. Back half of the weekend by afternoon should be dry. More storm chances return Tuesday of next week.